Hey guys, and here we are back with another video and I hope you are okay on that side of the screen. And today to share with you my opinion regarding the G-Chic OwnLap 1300M6H model, which is one of the latest uh, portable displays from G-Chic. I've been using it for about two weeks with my MacBook Pro and also a Windows computer, especially on one of the tasks that usually I bring from my work to home, which is at the end of the semester to put the student grades from an Excel sheet where I do all my calculations to the portal, in this particular case, the school portal where I work. And that's a task for at least two displays. And as I said, one of the things that I usually do, and those that know the channel for more time, you know that I usually had a triple display set up, but at this moment I've got an ultra wide uh, display. So usually I bring it home, but at this moment with the G-Chic 1306, I can do that task on my office or even on the classroom without any issues at all. Now I did a few tests and I'll share them with you. Just a few seconds to share with you a few things about the display itself, starting with the quick unboxing experience. What we will find inside the package is the Jeshik 1306 H, which I think I already mentioned it, which is a portable display, 13 inches. We also find a desk stand which will have an angle of 40 to 80 degrees, which I believe that it's enough for the angles that we will use while working. Also, it, uh, it comes with all the necessary cables and all the accessories. And then finally, it also has a really nice protective bag that we can put in to put inside our laptop bag or just to take the display as it is. Specifications and prices, I will leave a link down below so that you guys can check it all. But I would like to share here that this is a 1080 screen with 60 Hertz IPS glossy panel, which has advantages and disadvantages like everything else. One of the advantages is it has great colors and contrast, as you guys can see by some images right over there. I did shot a few uh, footages of YouTube playing right over there with a few colors so that you can check it out. Really, really nice. Even on some angles, we can watch it. Of course, I always exaggerate on the angles that I shoot and we will see the glossiness right over there, especially if we have a lot of light. If we are on a darker environment, it will be totally fine. But with lights like I do have here on the office, then will give us that clear. Now, the display itself, it's targeted, in my opinion, for this kind of work. Two displays work either on a Mac or a uh, Windows laptop. And one of the things that I do love is the USB Type-C port, which we can connect just one cable on a Mac or on a Windows. And that's about it. It will take the image and also take the uh, power through that cable so we don't need anything else we just need the laptop the cable and the display itself and that is it we are ready to roll nonetheless as you can see i also have a few machines right over there what i did do was to test out a setup which was with my mac mini actually this was a question that a guy asked on instagram and also on facebook and it's really possible if you already have a mac mini or similar computer and you want to have a portability option without having the need to buy another laptop, for example, then this is a good solution. All we need is a bag. I would suggest a full setup of keyboard and mouse so that I can leave it on the bag. And the only thing that I need to take on and off the bag is the Mac mini or other mini computer itself. And in this particular case, it would be more it would be cheaper than getting a laptop. Now, of course, if you are looking to get a laptop or a setup like this, probably it will make more sense the laptop itself. But if you already have everything and all you need is a spare portable display, then this is a option to consider. Now, I also played a few days ago with a Android TV box and also this display powered by a power bank. So no connection at all with uh, electricity. We could take it anywhere and it was just a crazy idea, but I did test it out and it worked great. Other scenario was with the Raspberry Pi 4, which is one of the smallest computers that we have used here and I use it a lot here on the channel. So that's not the portable setup that we can take anywhere with a lot of options that we can choose from and of course if we talk about mini computers we have covered quite a few dozens here on the channel and that opens a wide array of options that we can take anywhere like a portable setup with a 
mini desktop and then finally I also tested the GPD uh, mini laptop which is a 7 inch display Windows mini computer as you guys know I've reviewed it here on the channel and one of the biggest advantages of this uh, mini laptop is that we can take it almost on any pocket but if I need to work on a bigger display then that's where the G-Chic uh, comes in hand which I can just plug in that small computer to this bigger display and I can work like I would on any other computer so the options that we have right over here for this kind of display and this is the latest from g -Chic. I will leave once again the link down below so that you guys can check it all and that is it guys a lot of ideas I'm sure that you have a lot more ideas on how we can use this display effectively and I do believe that there isn't a correct way each one of us will have a different needs and each one of us will have a different target i just love the options that we have on gadgets such as this one and that is it hope that you guys enjoyed the video and if you did don't forget that usual thumbs up if you still have any questions leave them down below i will answer as best and as fast as i can as always my name is Roberto george and i'll see you guys on the next one